Hey guys, so today I'm going to be doing a back to school supplies haul because that's my favorite part of school. It's like the only part I actually like about school and I'm going to take my glasses off because there's probably a glare. Um, so I hope you guys like it. Um, so let's get started. So I've already gone through and organized all my stuff. So the first thing I'm going to do, open, is this box. It's just, this is one I'm going to keep in my locker and you'll see why in a minute. Um, I also have four notebooks and another pencil pouch, um, but I left them at my mom's house earlier, and so, yeah, I'll have to get them tomorrow. And whenever you open this, this is just an old lip balm, EOS lip balm, um, but it's, um, I just don't like having chap lips at school, because especially it gets, when it gets really windy outside, because gets windy in New Mexico, <laughs> then you're like, oh my gosh, it's so, your lips get really dry. The next thing I have, um, I think I got it from Walmart, it's just this ruler, it just says flex ruler on it, and it's really bendy, so yeah, that's cool. The next thing I have is a bottle of glue, because I need it for science, and then I have one of my pink erasers, because I make a lot of mistakes. And then I have four pens, and I don't take all my school supplies with me to school, I leave a lot of them at home. And then, get this, so we're not allowed to use mechanical pencils at our school. And so, at Office Max, they have these cool little pencils. I've seen them before, but normally you can tell that they're a real pencil, that they're not a real pencil and they're like mechanical. But these ones look like just like a regular pencil that you just like didn't, that's just been used a lot. And then, so yeah, I have a couple of those in my thing. Then I have a couple of plain old boring pencils, you know. Boring. Then I have some index cards. And that's all for the pink box. Okay, so this um, pencil slidey thing I actually keep in my backpack. Um, and then it's really jam-packed right now, and that's why I have my other pencil pouch. But the reason I keep something in my locker and something in my backpack is because I have one of everything, one or two of everything in all of my pouches. That way, like this one I keep in my backpack because I don't want to lug this big old box around all day. And so this way, um, I can if I take this out, I take it home and I forget it, then, oh, I have to put some color pencils in this, matte pencils. And that way, if I take this home and I forget it on my bed or something, or my desk, then I don't, I'm not going to be like, hey, mom, I left my school supplies at home, can you bring them to me? No. Because, no. So, that's why I keep this in my locker, that way, if I ever forget this, then, boom, I got some other school supplies. So, and I, and this Minnie Mouse, yes, it's Minnie Mouse, don't make fun, Minnie Mouse is awesome, you, she grows on you whenever your one-year-old sister, that's all she watches is Minnie Mouse and Mickey Mouse. So in here, I have post-it sticky flags, then I have a little glue stick, I have another eraser, my stepmom gave me this pink pen, it's really cool, it even writes in pink. And it's just an inner gel by Pentel. And then I have some more of those pencils, but these ones have grippies and erasers on them. Then I have another plain old boring pencil. Then I have a couple more pens. Some index cards. And some colored pencils. Okay, so the next thing I have is a couple boxes of Kleenex. Because there's always those teachers at my school um, that they say, if you don't bring me some Clorox wipes and Kleenex, you're not going to get a good grade. My language arts teacher last year, um, we had to bring Kleenex or Clorox wipes, two of one or four of them or two of each. Other, she graded us on it. it. If we only brought, like we could bring one box Kleenex and one Clorox wipe and that would be 100%. We could bring two box Kleenex and that'd be 100%. We could, if we only brought one, then that'd be 50%. You get it. 
And if we brought two of Clorox wipes and two of Kleenex, then we got 200%. So, knowing me, good grades to stay in sports, you gotta have good grades. And so I brought two of each. Extra credit, you know. The next thing I have, I did a DIY of it, is this is my planner. Because they hand out planners, but they don't work out too well. So yeah, I have a planner. The next thing I have is this binder I decoupaged with my grandma. Me and my grandma decoupaged it. Mod Podge, whatever you want to call it. And my grandma, she was in, she did school a few years ago. Yes, my grandma did school. She's only 40-something. And she gave me one of her folders. It's just pink polka dots on the outside and then stripes on the out in. And then in all my binders, I have some paper. Then I have one, two, four other folders because I have to have lots of folders. Bend over. The next thing I have is another binder for more classes, and this one also has paper. Hey, <laughs> that's upside down. <gasps> oh, and then I have a box of markers. Forgot about those. Then I have this little nifty little thing, and I'm going to put some hole punches in it and just use it to hold, like, loose papers for math, because I always lose my math stuff. And so, yeah. Then I have another little folder. Again, I'm holding it upside down. I have another binder. Then I wasn't able to do a DIY on this um, for back to school, but it's basically the same concept of the planner. It's this dumb dumb wrapper binder. And then I just have again some more notebook paper. And then hold on, I got a big. <laughs> Sorry, it was on the other side of my room. I have this big tote box, tote bag, tote bag, tote container? I don't know. It's a big plastic container that has a lid. It's a tote something. That's all I know. Don't ask me. And then I have some more things that I'm going to get from Dollar Tree because Dollar Tree's awesome. And so I'm going to get some like sticky notes and stuff from there. And then this is just some thing, it's just something I got from Dollar Tree. It's called Main Street Wall Creations. And I'm going to put these in my locker just to give it a little bit of a pop of color. The rest I hung up at my, in my room. Then it's this cool little nifty binder. It has a zipper and stuff on it. And then I can open up this pouch. And the first thing I have, okay, get this. It's a pen, but it looks like a syringe. I thought that was really cool. I got it from Dollar Tree. It came in a pack. Then um, I got these cool. I don't. My mom got them for me. I don't know where, but I got these cool little eraser things. This one has a froggy on it, on the end. This one has an owl. Don't you love owls? I love owls. Get that meant to focus. Probably isn't gonna focus. You go and then this one is just a rainbow star looks like a shooting star whenever you think about it the next thing I have I got these from Dollar Tree it's just a pack of a bunch of erasers and then I have a bunch of like colorful sheets of paper like little sheets of paper then I have some more pretend pencils I haven't opened them yet and then put all this stuff back in there. And you unzip it. And I have 
some tab dividers in here that I'm going to need for math class. Pre-algebra. Ugh, I hate math. But then you mix letters and math. It's like, people, not cool. Letters, math, stick them together. They don't go together. They really don't. Just separate them. Keep letters with English and stuff. And keep numbers with math. And we formulas to science. It's just not right. Anyway. And I had a Winnie the Pooh folder. Yes, Winnie the Pooh. whoop de doo It was it was pretty cute. It, had, it was like green. And then it had Winnie Pooh holding a jar of empty honey. And it had like a quote from Winnie the Pooh on it. I like inspirational quotes. Like, so yeah. Um, I also have a jump drive. It's like this big. It's really tiny, but I use it just so I, uh oh, sorry. I use it just to like keep all my papers and stuff on it. Um, cause then I don't want to lose papers and have to print them out at school. Cause our school doesn't have color printers. So if I'm doing a science project and it's supposed to have color, I don't want to color it. I can just print it with my color printer and it'll be awesome. Yeah, don't ask. But, um, I just have a little jump drive. It's downstairs, so. Oh, my sister actually has one right now. Ow, that was my foot. It's just really tiny. See? It's tiny. So, it looks like that. So, I almost forgot this last thing. Yeah, I just kind of threw everything over there. Yeah. I kind of forgot, um, I almost forgot it. It's this locker mate kit. And it just, it comes with... A locker shelf, a storage cup, a dry erase board, a dry erase marker, a mirror, and a couple magnets. <clears throat> and my stepmom got it for me. I'm I used to hate pink. And then my dad got together with my stepmom, and so it's now kind of growing on me. So yeah, I just got this cool little locker set. I wish she got purple or green. Those are my favorite colors, but she didn't. Okay. So so that's the end of my back to school supplies haul. I hope you liked. And so like, subscribe, um, comment what your must have for school supplies is. So, oh, I also got a water bottle because you get thirsty at school and scissors. I'm kidding. I also got some scissors, so like, subscribe, comment down below what your must-have school essential is, and see you next time. Bye!